And we're back, guys, with more UFC coverage. Estela Nunez from Brazil dislocates her elbow. That's right. This was a very, very short match. Dudakova, she went in for the takedown. That's right. She got a beautiful leg takedown. And Estela Nunez would literally just fall on her elbow, dislocating it. This is brutal, ladies and gentlemen. Estela on a three-match losing streak coming into this fight, literally fighting. She has not won a UFC match, fighting for her career. This is brutal. Uh, 34 seconds into round one, Dudakova goes for the single leg takedown, and literally Estela Nunez falls down on her left elbow. Now, personally, I've had this type of injury before. Normally, dislocating your elbow, uh, you, you need to fall from a reasonable amount of uh, distance. I dislocated my elbow uh, playing basketball, going in for a dunk. You know, someone shot the ball, they missed it, and I went in for a put-back dunk. And uh, this happened, I was only 17, 17 years old, so I went in for a put-back dunk. And I slipped off of the rim. So I didn't really have my balance going in for the dunk. Because as I'm going up, you know, one of the defenders kind of bumped me. So I'm, I'm still up in the air high enough to put the ball back to dunk it. But I couldn't get a grip as, I, as because of when I was going up for the ball, the, the defender kind of gave me like a little push. So I didn't have my full balance. But I was able to get up to the rim, put the ball back. The dunk miss, so you know, bounced high in the air because I missed the dunk. I missed the putback, but I, and then never had my full balance, so I slipped off of the rim, and then boom, I fell directly on my uh, right elbow, and that was brutal, ladies and gentlemen. Brutal, brutal, brutal. Uh, because I'm also right-handed, and this the pain from that. So I I know what Estella is feeling right now. That is a very painful injury. And it probably took me seven to eight months to recover, but ultimately that's what ruined um, my boxing career because after that, going into the gym, just punching for long extended amounts of time, my arm would just, it would uh, fatigue. And that's just the best way I can explain it. It's, it's after throwing 100, 200, 300 punches in practice and training, my arm would just start to fatigue and feel heavy and, and ache. And uh, that pain's never gone away. I mean, falling from literally 11 feet in the air on your elbow, it was it was painful. So I just want to say, hopefully Nunez can have a speedy recovery. Uh, much respect to Dudakova. She's still undefeated, guys. She is uh, she is really the next big thing. And um, Nunez, I just I really hope Nunez. I hope this does not cost her her career. Because uh, there's been talks of her literally uh, being cut from the UFC. But, I mean, she looked to be in amazing shape. Uh, I mean, the, I would have loved to see what would have happened on the feet between these two ladies. Uh, but, I mean, the strawweight division is just, it's wide open right now. And Dudakova is, she is a top prospect. And people are going to have to watch out for her. Uh, even though the fight only lasted 34 seconds, I mean, the, the stand-up game, it looked like Nunez came in there to strike. I mean, she's from Brazil, uh, even though she hasn't had success in the UFC so far. She's a great fighter. I mean, she was two for six on her total strikes. She landed one shot to the head, one shot to the body. And who knows what could have happened in this fight. But again, that's the leg takedown there. Uh, she went for the left leg takedown and Nunez fell on her left elbow. You can see the dislocation there. Look how that's painful. And again, normally, you, that's brutal. Normally, you dislocate your elbow falling from, you know, a higher distance than that. But you can't really count that as, you know, uh, a standard because it's, it's all about your body weight. You know, she fell on her complete body weight, which is probably on fight night, 120 pounds, 120 pounds falling, you know, especially with the pressure of falling from the takedown on your elbow. It's brutal. It's very brutal. Uh, what's next for Nunez? Uh, she mentioned to her fans, uh, she did send out a tweet, and just look at the elbow there. Ouch, that's brutal. And she's a warrior. She's she's taking the pain. Uh, Dudakova gets the victory. She mentioned to her fans that, look, 
She felt very strong. She prepared a lot for this fight, and she knew tonight was her night. This could have been her first win. This was her fight, she said, but I will come back stronger and show you all again. And we just want to send love uh, and healing to Nunez. Hopefully she can come back and at least get one more shot. That's not how you want your career to end. We'll be back, guys.